If you need Madden 21 coins for anything, make sure to go to buymuttcoins.com. Check it out with the link in the description, and my code MMG is 15% off. Hey, pack and play squad. Let's go. Welcome back, boys. Listen, 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 listen. Ooh, Ooh voice crack. I squeaked. I did. I squeaked. In high school or on the lunch table, if uh, our voice cracked, you would get viciously roasted until you admitted to the whole table that you squeaked. So, I squeaked. Look, I know for a fact that what I'm about to open in packs won't be in packs when you see this video, okay? I have the next like four days or five days with the video scheduled out, but hear me out. A lot all just dropped right now as I'm recording this, and it's huge for the Pack and Play squad. That's why I'm doing this. And the team does not reset until I make the playoffs. Originally, most fear dropped, there was like no halfbacks. And I was like, shit, I'm never gonna get a halfback. Well, they just dropped scary fast. Raheem Mostert, 92 speed, stud. Leonard Fournette, who is deceptively fast. I'm just surprised he got a card in this. 88 speed. They dropped the limiteds, which I pulled last time. I don't expect to pull one again, be honest with you. But Saquon Barkley, who I would love to just live out his legacy as if he didn't get that injury. And that is what I would love to do right now. So we have $100 worth or one bundle. Basically, I'm probably gonna go with the most feared bundle. It has a topper of two most feared fantasy packs. All I gotta snag is one of these halfbacks. Very likely should get Leonard Fournette. Starting out with Jesse James here, a Lions player. All right, I like the start. I don't think Madison is better than the Bo Jackson I have. Either way, I need a, I need a serious contending here. I think Fournette. Just even as low. Oh, I forgot about this. Oh, you saw the Luakon, the goat. He gets a scary fast right outside linebacker card. He's been playing super well for the Falcons on that atrocious team. If you guys watched Willamot in like, is it three years ago or two years ago? A long time ago, he was like the goat, dude. I love Oh, you saw the Luakon. Technically, I could do a set, but I think that goes against the rules of pack and play. So, oh, I pulled an 87, but it's Taylor Lewan. I'm still happy to have any 87. It's kind of hoping it'd be a 92. Obviously not. Noah Fant. Love that guy. That's going to be great. <laughs> Josh Norman. Scary strong Josh Norman. More like scary stiff armed. Get this shit out of here. Stupid. I'm not going to. Inaccurate. Landon Collins! Oh my god, I'm getting everyone not named Leonard Fournette! Shh. I just pulled an 86 overall kicker! I just pulled the best kicker in the game! Our most feared player! Oh, you saw we get a huge base elite David Bakhtiar. I already have an 87 left tackle. Let me get the wrong Devin McCourty. One most feared fantasy pack left. London Fletcher, Justin Jackson, Denzel Perryman. Yikes. Yikes, it's not the big animation. Matt Paradis, what is that? What is that? Oh! Oh my God! Oh my God! DJ Watt? Dude, I've never in my entire life seen that pack animation and it really just came down to the absolute last pack and we clutched it out. 90 overall speed rush for DJ Watt, he's gonna be a freak. <laughs> Bro, are you kidding? And I was talking at the start of this whole video all about halfbacks. This is the last thing I thought I was gonna pull and it's incredible. Holy shit, did that really just happen? 93 finesse moves, holy shit. I'm so excited to power that dude up and see what he can do. Now, this Henry Rugg is so fast, in fact, that he's actually gonna start over my Tyreek at slot, which is kind of crazy. I feel bad doing that, but look at that, Holy 93 shit. speed, and that's all I want at the slot. I'm gonna put Ruggs at wide receiver one. Woods will go two, and Cortland Sutton can be my slot. The most feared offensive line helping out, Trey Turner and Taylor Lewan, 85s. Noah Fant is my backup tight end behind Kittle. And then defensively insane, TJ Watt in at left outside linebacker, Landon Collins at strong safety. Devin McCourty at free safety. Cromartie, Malcolm Butler, Murphy Bunting, Dexter Lawrence. We already got that Aaron Donald. And then Foley side of Louis Khan. I gotta just completely gas this TJ Watt. He's gonna come off the edge so goddamn fast. We are gonna murk quarterbacks. With Aaron Donald on one edge and TJ Watt on the other, it's gonna be ridiculous. No surprise here, TJ Watt does get edge threat. Honestly, the only ability worth playing on some of these guys. 86 overall team. This is significantly better by Wilma team after only a couple episodes here. I might see if Landon Collins gets Acrobat. He does not, but he does get Enforcer. Wait, holy shit. Enforcer's nowhere near as good this year, but I have three points left, so I'm gonna go Enforcer Landon Collins. Whoa, this defense just got really good.
good. This is too funny to me. We come in for a halfback, we get all of this and no halfback. The halfback will have to wait, but I'm ready to hop into a game, so let's do this shit. That's the guy I wanted! That's the mustard I wanted! Uh, all right, first and 10. Uh-oh, yeah, that mustard is fast. Aaron Donald on the left, TJ Watt on the right, that's sick. I think we're gonna see a lot of uh, of run plays from this dude too, so we're gonna need them to step up. Is it another run play? I'm gonna bring my 81 overall Palomalu down to hopefully make a play here. It is another run play. We're getting to the edge, he jukes his side, and that is a stop, fourth and one. You know he's gonna go for it. Especially after running stretch, three straight plays. Fourth and one, probably coming right up the middle. Wait a minute. <laughs> you gotta delay a game. Fourth and six now. I'd be surprised if he went a run play here. Play action. Yup, and he's coming left side. Going right. Trash. Trash throw, lucky catch. Congratulations, my friend. You get another set of downs with which you will run halfback stretch. Look at this dude. <laughs> Third and four, could be in a similar situation. I'm gonna blitz those two. And then Collins has just gotta make the play if this is a stretch. Here. Yep, it's a stretch. I gotta make the play with Collins. That's what I said I do! Let's go! Fourth and two. Yo, that's why I put Enforcer on the man. That Enforcer call was actually huge now. This could be interesting. Oh, he QB draws. This, this guy's a little bitch. I'm really gonna run stretch left, stretch right, and then QB draw. This is gonna feel good. If we can if we walk out of here with a dub, I'll feel real good. This is the kind of games where I really hope that like EA developers see and realize, oh yeah, the ultimate team mode we just built is not enjoyable online when people do this exploitable shit. Congrats, bro. Congrats, congrats. Oh! I got even mad. Now I just really hope the devs see this video. First and ten. I'm gonna start out with a run play of my own. This man was this man was showing me the damage you can do. I take four yards. I don't really have a stud halfback though, and that's kind of my issue right here. So he's gonna be in cover one hole the whole game. I'm not shocked. Uh, I should hopefully be able to hit rugs here. Yup. Oh, use those wheels, rugs. Huge catch. But we're looking at fourth and inches. I'm just gonna hand this off Bo Jackson real quick. Yes, Perfect. sir! Let's go. That's a big conversion. You know what I could do? If I use this clock perfectly, I chew clock, I score a touchdown, he has no time, and then I get the ball at half. That's gonna be big in this game. All right, outside zone, getting some very solid blocks. Yeah, I know, you're gonna run man coverage. Congratulations. All right, second and seven. I'm just gonna throw underneath because this is man. Very exploitable. Oh, there's cover three. I, I respect the switch up. First and 10, we are burning the clock exactly as I wanted to. Get the play action here and let's see which one he bites on. Easy, easy read, stay in bounds. All right, there's five yards. Clock continues to burn. Gonna block Bo, I'm looking for Robert Woods here. Oh, Stafford, throw that! Woods, let's go! What a ball! Huge play right there. I'm gonna do rugs and woods underneath. You can't tell I'm trying really hard right now. I would love to beat this guy. Let's see which one he commits to. All right, perfect. Just throw the other one. The good thing is we have three timeouts. I'm gonna make a bunch of pass audibles, hit an inside zone, and hope we get lucky on some blocks. Oh, it's halfback base though, and Madison is in. I don't know how I feel about this. I'm gonna try it anyway though, because we got timeouts here. Good, good, good. Yes, sir. First down, reach for it. What if I hit him with stretch? This is literally all the man's been running. What if I hit him with stretch? Dude, if I score on stretch, I'm gonna cry. I have two timeouts left in his first day goal. Oh my God, this is gonna make my day. It looks open on the left side. It really does. Oh no, what are we doing? But I'm gonna fake like I'm switching sides. I'm gonna come right back left side. I wanna score on stretch. Even if this isn't the play here. Second and goal, I'm going left side again with the stretch, cut it up the middle. Get up. Halfback stretch, baby. Two can play that game, my friend. And we drill the kick, whoo! Seven to seven with four seconds left. That is perfect execution. I would like to say that was perfect execution of what we wanted to do there. And now we get the ball half and just gotta put up a field goal to take the lead. Pack and play squad, we're gonna beat a cheeser and it's gonna be, ooh, it's gonna be a big day. Oh, he just made a fucking mistake. He just made a huge, huge mistake. That's cover two. Is it? Is it? Yup! Let's go! Henry Ruggs, 93 speed! 
Front cover to again, my guy. Let's go! Big time, baby! Dude, like, if you're an offensive coordinator like Pop Meeks right there, everything I said has come true up until this point. To chew that clock, get the touchdown with no time left, and then score at half. So we got a seven-point lead. We just gotta, we just gotta keep it locked up, play the football we know. Yeah, I'm taking this seriously. This isn't even like Wilma Super Bowl. I'm taking this seriously. Okay, so this is the stretch. God, that's so bogus, dude. I'm just going Palomalu, I guess, so I can get some safety help in there. Great tackle. The good thing is this chews a lot of clock, and he's losing. He's going to the counter. Oh, he flip, flip sides. Everybody's there. Everybody's there. I'm honestly fine with this. If you score, I'm going to have the ball with two minutes left. So he's got wide side stretch now. Can we get around it? No, but that's a tackle. That's a tackle. Ooh. Clock's chewing. This is what I'm talking about, dude. Oh, is he passing? Oh, wait, 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 QB draw. I'll be in trouble if I guess QB draw and it's not, so. Whoa. I didn't even, it's in a base cover three. I don't know why that got dotted up so bad. Second and 12, I might be able to get Kittle just up the seam too. Yup. Wow, his user was there, but Gunslinger chucks that shit. Big time just got away with one. I don't think that's cover two. Oh my God, that's cover two. Dude, you're an idiot! Stop running cover two! I'll do that to you every single time if you if you switch your ass into cover two. I'm pissed. I don't want my touchdown if you're gonna do that shit. Respect me, okay? Mr. Halfback Stretch. Come on, let's see halfback stretch, buddy. Chew the whole goddamn clock for me. I think this is the right side stretch, yeah? Maybe he autoed it back left. Yup, counter, counter. Oh uh -oh. no, I missed with Palomalu. Get the angle, get the angle, get the angle. How much you gotta do, man? Run stretch, run counter, run stretch, run counter, run stretch, run counter. I think McCordy's the man I stay on here. Cause he either runs stretch and I'm in position or he runs counter and I can cover back. All right, so there's the dive. Come on, Palomalu, okay. Solid stuff, not exactly what I was looking for, but we will definitely take that. All right, we know this puppy's a run. Let's see what Van Noy can do to stop it. This is a stretch. Yes, 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 yes! Let's go! Fourth and inches! Damn, we really could actually end the game here if we get this goal line stop. I'm guessing run up the middle. Pitch! I'm on Van Noy! Oh. He's just too fast! Van Noy is not built for that. Good play call, my friend. Good play call. I've scored every time thus far. This is not gonna be the time that I fumble the bag. Let's get it here, boys. That is very rightfully so a cover one. Let's see if Ruggs will just beat his man deep. It's kind of... He did not, bro. <gasps> Stupid. What? Oh, dude, he had like two feet on him. I'm kind of sad going out like that, but dude, did I really make the wrong play? I thought Ruggs had him toasted. I don't have the two minute warning on my side. He actually could end the game. If he gets a first down and choose enough clock, the game would be over. I almost should let him score here, do a Falcons. Wait. <laughs> this was the Falcons Lions play. I gotta let him score there. If he kneels that ball after the first down, it's over. You chew the clock and kick the field goal. I'm so surprised that he kicked that he did that. A minute 19, three timeouts. The game is still within reach. He just has man coverage on two sides. So we're gonna just make the read here. Yep, goes to B. We throw X. Out of bounds too. That's big. Huge gain there. You wouldn't switch on. Would you expect the guy to switch on and make the tackle by himself based on how he's been playing this game? He seriously made a mental error though. I'm telling you, bro. That was a big error he made. Can't score. I can't score there. I can't score there because he gets the ball back. If I give him 58 seconds and three timeouts, he will run stretch, 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 burst and kill me. I have to score and take this into overtime. I cannot leave this up to him because I will lose. We're going with the stretch because fuck this guy. Let's go down to the one. Get shit on. Look how basic your fucking offense is. It's gonna come down to whoever gets this coin toss in OT. He who gets coin toss wins, assuming it goes OT. This is his fault that it's not over. It's his fault it's not over because he shouldn't have scored. He should have knelt the ball. Oh, you want to take this out? Fumble! My fucking ball! Let's go! Cheesy ass bullshit offense. This guy, get up! I'm not even going 
to take this out. And I'm gonna run half back stretch on you for it. How's that make you feel, man? You're gonna lose half back stretch. That's tough, bro. This is yes, your play. Sir. You taught yes, me how sir. to run it. This is my most monumental dub to date. I'm not kidding. I care more about this win than probably any wheel em up win. And the funny thing is a lot of people who don't watch your pack and play series are not gonna see this monumental W. Second and three, we're going short side. Just gonna cut it back up the middle. Bo Jackson's gonna break a tackle. <laughs> oh, he fumbled. Dude, imagine if that was me who fumbled, bro. Probably would have cried until, I mean, who knows when. Get swerved. You're bad. You're straight up bad. How does halfback stretch feel, mate? Yo, if you were along for the ride in that fucking sick game, Congratulations, you just watched one of the best Madden games literally on my channel. It's 21 to 21, and he walks in a stretch. Maybe to showboat, maybe because he doesn't have the football IQ. I don't know, but that lost him the game. Hold on, I gotta send him a message. Maybe run stretch. Oh my God, Lions Falcons. Dude, who else is gonna pull off the dub after he scores that Todd Gurley touchdown than Matthew Stafford? Who else is gonna do it, bro? He completed two passes the whole game. The scary pass Raheem Mostert, who I was going for. I wanted this. 154 yards. This is the stat that should piss you off. He has 154 yards on a single broken tackle. This wasn't like some nutty ass, super lucky shit. Literally just has to run stretch left and right. And he just gets 10 yards every play. I'm sorry, bro, but um, get shit on. That's the game of the year. That's the game of the year. This image right here that I'm looking at will be ingrained in my brain for the next three weeks, dude. When I lose a big game, I, I think about it for like months. I'm not kidding, a big Madden game. And when I win a big game like that, it reinstills the fucking fire. Yeah, it's probably not that deep for some of you. It's that deep for me. I forgot about the one of the most important things in pack and play, which is for every touchdown I score, I get to open a pack. Your man just scored five touchdowns. I'm gonna open up this bundle, actually. Oh yeah, I'm gonna open up that bundle because that's four packs plus the top. I'm always excited for you guys to see videos, but you know, sometimes I know a video isn't as much of a banger as another video. Like, I'm not fucking stupid. I don't think every single video I've ever put out is the best video ever. This is in my top five in recent memory right now. Oh my God, let's go. So again, pack and play series. If I get a dub, I get one pack per touchdown and that was a insane game right there the five touchdowns so we got a lot of chances to actually get the halfback that i've been looking for after how amazing that game went i just have a really good feeling that we are going to get the halfback we want no offense again bo jackson 82 rod woodson rod woodson's probably good here let's get that halfback i know my halfbacks bingo come on This is the best Madden video I've made this year. This is the best Madden video I've made this year. Oh my God. This is the coolest thing that is Jalen Ramsey. Casually pulled Jalen Ramsey. You know what? I don't need a halfback anymore. I don't need my halfback at this point. I will take an 87 D tackle. I'm running out of voice. I don't even know what to say right now. This is why we make videos, boys. We make videos for moments like this. That's a big elite. Mitchell Schwartz. Good Lord. DJ Watt. It's not a boss, DJ Watt. Whoa! Come on, man! How perfect is that? He lost the game off of the Todd Gurley play, and I get Todd Gurley. This is the coolest fucking video I've ever made. Let me look at this card, bro. 90 speed, 94 jump, 90 catch. He's so good. This doesn't feel real at all. This is a masterpiece. Hey, you, you guys know I love you so much. I'm in an awesome mood. I'm gonna go celebrate this W. And I will see you on the next Pack and Play series episode. Thank you for watching as always. Peace out.